Jack wishes to purchase a used car that has a cash price of $11,000. Now, assuming that he doesn't have $11,000 to give to the seller, he's going to have to borrow it from the bank. So a bank is going to offer him 36 monthly payments of $352.36 per payment. First thing we want to find out is how much does Jack have to pay in all what is the total installment price for the life of the loan? We want to multiply the number of payments times the payment amount in order to get the total installment price. So it's 36 payments, and we're going to multiply by the 352.36 per payment. It's 12,684.96. Okay, then they're asking us for what is the finance charge in dollars. So he's paying more than 11,000 for sure. We need to know exactly how much more he's paying. That's going to be the finance charge. So I'll take that total installment price and then subtract the principal. Basically the formula that I'm doing there is I equals A minus P. So it will be 12,684.96 minus the 11,000 borrowed. His interest amount then is 1,000. 684.96 as a dollar amount but we have to figure out now how much is that as a percent of the principal that's actually the value called F in these problems so the finance charge as a percent of principal is found by dividing that interest by the principal and then you could multiply it by 100 in order to turn it into a percent. So it's I over P times 100. Interest was 1684 divided by 11,000. And let's see what that is. It's 0 0.153 times 100, which is 15.3%. All right, so he's got to pay 15.3% of the cost in addition to the vehicle itself. All right, from that information, we can now find the APR of the loan, and we could use the table or the formula. See, there's a formula for F, and the formula is RT, RT over one minus one plus R over N to the negative, okay. Yeah, that's the formula for the finance charge as a percent of the principal. Uh, so the easy way would, of course, be the table. We have a 36-month loan, so we want to look in the row for 36 months. Okay, then we would want to go to a value of 15.3 if we can find it. And yeah, right there is 15.32. And we'll see what column that came from. It came from an APR of 